I would like to ask my colleagues for their unanimous support of House Resolution 964, which honors the memory of former Hazelton Mayor John Ford. Mayor Ford passed away in May at the age of 84. He did not start out as a public official, but as a businessman. Mayor Ford left school at the age of 16 to work at a Chevrolet dealership. He became a certified mechanic, and he also earned his GED by taking classes at night. Mayor Ford eventually opened his own business, uh, two businesses, Hazelton Standard Fuel Company and John Ford Trucking, which he ran until he passed away. In addition to being an entrepreneur, John Ford was also a committed public official who served as the mayor of Hazleton from 1986 to 1987 and for two years as a city council member after that. Mayor Ford worked tire tirelessly for the betterment of the city and his major accomplishments include the revitalization of Columbus Park, the reinvention of the bus transportation system, and the preservation of historic landmarks. Mayor Ford is remembered fondly, fondly for his community, minded, spirit, and generosity. He was a true gentleman who loved his family, his church, and his hometown. Mayor Ford was one of the first politicians that I met early on in my short career so far, and I appreciated all of the wonderful advice that he gave me through those years. He was a mentor to many local public officials from the Hazleton area, and um, we have Congressman Lou Barletta was one of those, Hazleton City Council member Jeff Cassatt, Hazel Township Supervisor William Gallagher, former Mayor Michael Marcicano, and Hazel Township Auditor John Busher and his nephew and Lower Dauphin School, School Board member Kevin Busher, who are with us today. John always reminded us that we were servants of the people and that we should win with humility and lose with dignity. And his wife, Rose, she could not be here today, but she said it best uh, in words that she wrote to me in a letter. She stated about her husband, while he walked the highest corridors of government with presidents, senators, representatives, and governors ever ready to offer his counsel and support, John remained a humble and quiet man, never seeking the accolades and honors afforded to those who expend their lives in public service. She wrote, he was a man who came from simple beginnings, and he not only believed in the American dream, but made it a reality through hard work, diligence, and a determined spirit. He held close to his heart the ideals that made America the exceptional nation that it is, and, a and he was a brilliant light in an off-darkened world. Mr. Speaker, we are joined also on the House floor today by members of his family, which are sitting to the left, his sister, Ida Gallagher, his sister-in-law, Susan Ford, his niece, Linda Busher, and if all of his guests could just rise again so we can uh, applaud and commend you. Thank you for coming. Um, you have done him an honor. Uh, thank you for being here today to be here for this resolution. On behalf of the Pennsylvania House of Representatives, we offer our sincerest condolences for your loss. Please know that, the Mayor, that Mayor John Ford is missed by the city of Hazleton and all who knew him. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.